So in this video, what we need to do is put the integers into ascending order. So from the smallest to the largest. Now the key word here is of course integers, and you should recognize that all of the numbers here are integers. So first one, nice and basic, start off with the smallest number, which is three. So three, so you can cross them off as you go if you like. Then we're going to have 7, which is the next smallest. Then we're going to have 8. Then we're going to have 20. OK, and we're done. So that's the first one, nice and easy. Right, number 2. Again, find the smallest number first, which is 82. OK, then the next smallest will be 970. Then the next smallest will be 1002. And the next smallest will be 2003. OK, and so they are now in order. Now for number three, we're going into negative integers here. So, when we talk about negative integers, the smallest is the most negative, okay? So the smallest here is minus 16. So if you want to, you can think of these as temperatures going from the coldest to the warmest. So minus 16 degrees centigrade is colder than minus 8 degrees centigrade, for example. So minus 16 would be first. Then we'll have minus 8. Then we'll have minus 5. Then we'll have minus 2. OK? And that's the third set of integers put into ascending order. Now, for number 4, we've got a mixture now of positive and negative integers. So, the most negative is minus 35, so that's going to go first. Then we've got minus 30. Then we'll have 5. OK, so once we've got rid of all the negative numbers, then we just go to the smallest number that we've got, 5. And then 15. OK, so that's number 4. Now, last but not least, we've got uh, some positive, uh, some negative three-digit numbers. So focus on the negative ones first. Go for the most negative, which is minus 683. OK, so we've got two negatives left over. So the most negative now is minus 602. Then we've got the minus 498. And then we've got 705. OK? And so then we've put each of these into ascending order.